Hey everybody, the Reese Wirral here, and welcome back to more of Anachronox. Now I'm not entirely sure if everything looks okay. I'm hoping it does, but I don't know. Essentially I ran into a bit of an issue um, earlier when I recorded this, because for some reason I decided to interact with the voter, whatever the hell it's called, the voter terminal, and as a result, like once you go into it, you can't back out of it. So I was kind of boned because I really wanted to see what you know what was in it and uh, oh no it was more the fact I wanted to interact with it to see what the hell it was and then I figured out I was like oh no and I tried all that I could to try and get out of it nothing worked not the greatest if I'm uh, being completely honest yeah it was a bit of a pain in the ass but what I'm trying to wait and see is for my stream to load on my phone, but my phone's being a piece of garbage. No, I'm waiting for the the stream to load so I can see how it looks, and I'll be like, okay, that's how it should look. Because I don't want it to be super, super bright or super dark. But it reset my gamma because the game crashed when I tried to reload an autosave. It was retarded. And every time I tried to load that save, it just crashed. Okay, if I look at how this looks, I can get that big play button to bugger off. I think that's fine. Yeah, it looks okay. No, I just need to check Twitter, just to make sure it tweeted out the right thing. Also, I came back this way because I know that we need Roboman for something. Sorry, Grumpos. Yeah, we don't need Grumpos. At least... Well, I mean, the task we have to do currently is all of this. So, okay, I did... Oh wait, did it tweet? Crap, I don't even know. Ah! Such a mess. No, what we're trying to do is find out all about propositions and like what the council are going to vote. Because essentially to become an ally of the council, you need to become... Uh, you need to vote like they... like they do. So we're going around the city, finding out all the propositions. I managed to find out five, I think. And then I ran into the issue of going to... I used the voter box and it kind of screwed me. Okay, the tweet went out. All's good. Yeah, cause I always check on my phone when I'm doing PC stuff because I don't know if it ever tweets out the right game or if I forgot to change it. But, seems not the case. Right, so now I can actually begin with finding all the people that have the pearls of wisdom or whatever they are. It's honestly not that bad. I think I had a couple that I didn't, that I couldn't get. Oh, it was more the fact I had a couple that I never found. It's not the fact I couldn't get them, it's just I never found them. But you're not one of them. And I now know what the pearls are. It's these things in the side of their head. Yeah. Right, so... You are also not one of them. I'm just double checking everybody now. Now that I know what they actually do look like. Yeah, you're not either. Alright, cool. <laughs> Thanks! There should be at least... You'd think there'd be a couple around. But maybe not. Also, I got to use Roboman's ability for the first time, and oh my, is it strange. It's really weird. I, re I honestly don't understand how it works, but I managed to use it, so there's a positive. You're not one of them either. No. Alright. Alright, well, here's where I made it to. But worst part is, I, was rec I recorded for like 40 minutes, and then I screwed it up because I didn't save. I made next to no manual saves. Either way, there are farms in the agricultural sections of the ring that grow hundreds of varieties of vegetables. One of these vegetables, the squiz squizzle beet, is quite poisonous. If the chef doesn't prepare it just right, it can be fatal. But it's the poison that gives the beet its distinctive flavour. I had a really itchy ear. Alright, cool. All well, uh, as well. As personally being an ally of the High Council, my sister is an assistant for one of them. Last night she told me how they voted on position... Proposition 3. My, my, my. Did you see his eyes light up? I bet you're just dying to know how they voted. You better take advantage of this situation. Yes, quick thinking, my friend. I just noticed I'm rather thirsty. I'll tell you how the council voted on Proposition 3 if you bring me a tasty quack quack juice from Jet June Juices. Uh, Jet June, not Jet June. So Jet June Juices. You got it, buddy. Magnificent speaker, isn't he? In addition to teaching public speaking at the university, he's also the chairman of Bipedry Salvation, a non-profit organisation dedicated to the plight of the little workers. He told me he was made aware of the High Council's vote on Proposition 6 this morning. 
and although I couldn't get him to spill the beans, I felt like I was wearing him down. I'm sure someone can get him to spill the beans on the High Council's Proposition 6 vote. Oh, crap. Maybe this is what I need Grumpus for. Shit. Either way, we'll see. Got a funny feeling I'm being watched. Alright. His shit wet. Look at his pants. And his shoes are scuffed. He must not know what he's talking about. Oh, his shirt's not very well ironed. That's what he says. I've only got one thing to say any to anyone thinking of voting against Proposition 6, and it's this. So, Democrats are Democrats. I don't know what the hell they are. Do not eat bipedry meat, period. Bipedry are too productive to waste as food. Most ring dwellers are unaware that nearly 3,000 bipedry were slaughtered on the surface of Democratus for the purpose of an outdoor activity called globbering. Bipedry I bound for slaughter are often crowded in car into cargo pens made for smaller animals and travel many cycles without sustenance. It's painful and cruel, and we must put a stop to it. So I actually speak with him again. Bipedry salvation is not a collective collection of knee-jerk activists looking for a cause. We're responsible members of the community. I myself am, am an ally of the council who believes in death with dignity for every Pipedry, and we are open to discuss. Shit. I think I need Grumpus for this guy. Ah, oh, no. Crap. If only I knew. Oh, well. I'll deal with the other ones first. I guess. I'm not able to use space for anything. Space is usually the interaction button, but whatever. I sense a demonstration forming down there. I should call for backup. Can't have every voice heard, know what I mean? Not particularly, but sure, I guess. There's a few of us who think the High Council is ineffective as a form of government. If the High Council decides the initiatives, and everyone votes how the Council would vote, is that really a democracy? I think Hal Halpert's the only member of the Council who represents how the everyday person really thinks. Hmm. Yeah, they don't say anything else. I remember what most of the people say. I can't, you know, remember it verbatim. Like, word for word. That's the voters' fucking box. Ugh. I need to just remember so I don't accidentally use the bloody thing. Wait, can I actually... Wait, I want the door to close. I want to see if I can open it with spacebar. It's normally the action button, but for some reason it's not working. Yeah, it's not working. What the hell? So, what's this guy say? So many votes and ballots and petitions and straw polls and referendums, it's too overwhelming. Is someone going to order? Wait. Quit complaining you're married. Why do you need time with yourself? Okay. Right, so this is where we get the quack quack juice. Welcome to Jejun Juices! It's our mission to provide the voters of Democrats with the highest standards of excellence in the purchasing, juicing, and fresh delivery of our drinks. More refreshing ginger are bollocks. I didn't want to get that one, you penis. I bought a brain freeze. I want quack quack. Quackity quack. Fucking gin. It was a brain thing. What's it called? Brain, brain, brain. It's not anywhere here. Where's the crack quack juice then? I don't know. Whatever. I guess. Won't have to matter. Wait. Oh, that guy's not even a. Oh, I thought he was part of the council. They're gonna vote me off the committee. I wasn't good enough and they're gonna throw me out of my hide. I have to live in section 3 with the rest of the burnouts. I'm gonna tell my parents. Alright, that's all he says. Whoop. You're not an ally of the council. We don't talk about the Emperor. He was an evil man. We are glad he's gone. Uh, okay. That's all he says. Perfect. Right, well, we've got the quack quack juice, so that's proposition number... Oh, the second proposition that we've learned about. Still, I'm really tempted to go back and get Grumpus. Yeah. I'm assuming that's what he's used for, but I don't know. Sorry, I'll just... I'll finish all the ones that I... I know about first, and then I'll come back and try out different things. Didn't actually- I oh, didn't think you were actually gonna get me a juice. You've made my day. The inside scoop is that the High Council will vote no on Proposition 3. Alright, so there's one. We've only got one of them. The worst part is you have to remember this. Yeah, you have to remember the votes. Which is really quite bad. Mm-hmm. This is my first date. How does it look like it's going? His hand is totally sweaty. I can smell it from here. Yeah. Boy, I hope she doesn't think I'm dumb. I want I want her to like me. I'm afraid to hold her hand. My palms all sweaty. Hey, go talk to her. Distract her for a second. I need to formulate a new strategy. Oh. What a creep. Does he think I can't hear him talking to you? I'm sitting right here. Go tell him I think he's a loser. 
<laughs> really, we're doing this? Don't bother, I heard. <laughs> uh, that's the best. <laughs> we're getting me to take messages between the two of you. I've been watching you. Are you going to talk to everyone in the city? Uh, that's the plan. Wait, so who are these? Oh, he's sad. Everyone has a voice. My foot. My friend doesn't. Oh. Okay, that's all you say. You're just a very angry individual. I can't... Oh! This might be where there's one of them. I never went into this. Bum. Bum. Let's try zero. Ba 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 ba. Okay, try three then. Four? Oh god. I'm doing bad. There's one. Four, nine. Okay, four, seven. Six. Okay, four, five. Ding, ding. I just hope I can get through. It's either one or three. Ding, 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 ding. Uh, oh, this is totally where there's another one. Whoa, soda machines. Whoa. Wait, there's elevators? The fuck? I see a trash bin. <gasps> Whoa. I'm looking around to see if there's like anything I can interface with. With PAL? It's not looking like it. Wait, I can't do anything in here. What? Wait a sec, what is this? It's... An old... Duke Lion Gel. Shield Gel. Shield Cell. God, I can't talk. Lolala. Like boots. Actually, yeah, equip. Equip, equip. Is that better? Wait, what? So keep... Energy shield is... Oh, whoa. There we go. Oh, yeah. I have no energy, though. I don't care. I'd prefer to have a better shield. Woohoo! So that just got me a very nice shield. Not too shabby. So what's over here? What do you think about yesterday's shield proposal? Personally, I don't see the need for a permanent security shield around our homeworld. It's not like our planet's in any danger of getting attacked by outworlders. Right? You like us, don't you? Who would ever want to make war on us? We're a peaceful people. Hey, what if I decided not to vote today? They'll find you and they'll club you to- uh, club you, and they said club you to death. Over and over again. Do you have a ship? You gotta get me out of here. So what's say, where's my cursor? Cotacom sent me here to negotiate a distribution deal with the Democrat and Trade Commission. Hold on, before you run off to slit your wrists, let me tell you what I know. They have amazing technology, would not believe the stuff they can do. They could be flying around here in stylized mechanoids in a beautiful, beautiful zero-g city if they wanted to, but the whole planet is paralyzed by indecision and red tape. They can't get a damn thing done to save their lives. And yet again I lost my cursor. Where the fuck did it keep disappearing to? Everyone's an administrator, I haven't met one scientist or artist in six months. Look around you, unimaginative middle management types are everywhere. I want to blow my brains out. Yeah, my cursor always disappears, that's weird. And no one's in charge around here. They don't even have a commander-in-chief for their military. No one wants to be accountable, so they vote on everything, and if something bad happens, it's not any individual's fault. It's everyone's fault. Where's my cursor? Ah. I give him six months before they self-destruct. That's where I gotta get out of this place. Please, take me with you. Nah. <laughs> no, thanks. Right, this guy's got a thing. I made friends with an outworlder. Many years ago, when our society was not so isolationist. It wasn't long before this friend offered me Naki. I was young. I didn't know any better. Before I knew it, I was hooked. It took me years to recover from the addiction. I will never trust an outworlder again. I'm proud to be an ally of the Council. They're right in voting yes on Proposition 5. Outworlders who spread their poison into our society deserve to die. Trouble me no more. There's this too. Whoa, where the hell do you come from? I'm a Vokar. I'm an officer of the law. Doesn't need to be buried in body armor to be an effective crime fighter. All I need is my stun wand and my reflexes. Okay. I did not see him before. That's really weird. Just appears behind me. Hey! How you doing? I think human males such as yourself are incredibly attractive, but they don't seem very interested in Democrat and women. I guess we're not lumpy enough for you. Being an outworlder, how do you feel about Proposition 8, which would forbid marriages between ring dwellers and human planet dwellers? 
Being an ally of the council, I know how the vote will sway. I'm just curious what you think. I'll tell you which way they voted if you're willing to give me a kiss. Oh god. <laughs> Pucker up, sweetie. Pucker up, sweetie, you're my first action in years. Stop, I'm gonna blush. Okay, I'm ready. Oh. My. I'm feeling a little faint. Too bad the High Council voted yes on Proposition 8. I hope I'll bag one of you sooner or later. Thanks for the thrill. <laughs> uh, that was one I never got before. I never found him. There are still some of us who believe the surface of the planet is where we belong. We've been living up in this ring so long that we've lost touch with ourselves as a, as a people. There you are. Mr. Kiba wants you to know that the Council is still in session and will remain at so for quite a while longer. We apologise for any inconvenience, but I'm sure you understand our, pos your, uh, our position. Domestic matters must take precedent in this case. You got it, buddy. Oh, man. So I just had to give somebody a kiss. Not too shabby. Wasn't too difficult. Oh, yeah, we have the lost and found bot. Greetings, I'm your interface. For the Votown lost and found, I'm a standard issue Buddy12 Bebobot. I have no add-on infrared interfaces, advanced heuristics, or remote communication skills of any kind. It is okay. I do not mind. I am I perfectly happy being on the very bottom rung of the very tall ladder of models of Bebobots. It suits me fine that each and every other Bebobot is leaps and bounds better than me. Nothing I like better than the bottom of the food chain existence here, looking for useless items that my oh-so-smart masters have left behind. Stuff a pocket calculator could keep track of. But I digress. How may I help you, sir? I want to help you find stuff. Oh yes, please. Thank you so much for your kind assistance. Two bits of advice, do not bother the council, Bebo bots have scoured that area. And butler bots are constantly cleaning the Republic Inn, so the item must have been left around Votown somewhere. Hurry, because someone might find it and take it. Okay, get ready, locate a blue desk lamp. Go! Wait a minute. Is that not what I've already found? Also, I like how that's randomized. The last time I did that, it was a camera. Wait, it, this is a blue desk lamp? Okay, it's probably just on the street, I guess. Ah, oh, crap. The fact it's randomized makes this harder. Yeah, kinda. Yeah, a blue desk lamp. Yeah, the camera was like right over there. It was really easy to find. This one, not so much. I mean, it's probably still easy to find. It's just, it's in a different spot. One thing I'm curious of is it's, if it's in this area or if it's elsewhere. Hmm. Wait, is there another one up there? Hold up. Oh, you don't have any pearls of wisdom, so you're useless. <coughs> okay. A blue desk lamp. I know there's that interface there, but I'm waiting to do that. No real reason. It's just what I think I'll do. Heard from a friend who works the hangar bays that the Sentry Robots are on full alert. I swear, how can they have practice drills so often? Okay, so there's that. I heard the High Council's called an emergency session this morning. I bet they're just coming up with tomorrow's initiatives. Alright. Since you're a planet dweller, you might not be bright enough to realise you're not on the surface anymore. That band you saw across the sky and thought was a garden through rocks at? Well, that's where you are right now, in geosynchronous orbit around the planet. Can you say geosynchronous? Those four gentlemen over there are the most renowned engineers in Votown. They designed the ring we're standing on right now. Ooh, aren't they fancy? So who are you? Greetings, I am... I am a Buddy 12 Bubbly Barbara. Personal assistance. Uh, assistant. I serve all my owner's emotional and filing needs. My owner is currently unavailable. We should have had a blueprint from the very beginning. You can't improvise architecture. Will you stop being so moody, Pronto? Be glad you're not stuck working on the surface of the planet. We're allies of the Council. Let's act like it and focus. My buddy 12 just received a memo from the High Council detailing their decision on Proposition 1. The maximum ramp angle initiative? Who cares about that? Why don't we build a shell around the planet instead? Pretend it never even existed. We could become a new Democratus. Screw the maximum ramp angle initiative. They just go in to make us do something stupid. We stop complaining, let's focus on the High Council memo concerning Proposition 1 that my buddy 12 just received. But not until these und undesirables leave the area. Right, so what we need to do is use PAL and interface with the robot. Beep, boop, boop, beep. In fact, can I remember this? I wonder. I'm pretty sure it's that. For like th two times.
I may have got that wrong. Oh no, I got it. Ding, ding, woohoo! Yeah! So, memo to Brady Day, Senior Interring Architect, from Miss Redfoot, Vice Secretary of Democratis High Council. I've just been made aware that the High Council's decision vis-a-vis -vis Proposition 1 will affect this quarter's architecture budget. The Council unanimously decided to vote yes on the measure, meaning all ramps in the interring that exceed 45 degrees must be redesigned and rebuilt. Please adjust your expenditure estimates accordingly. We love your work. Sincerely, Miss Redfoot. That was fantastic. I can't believe how much science you know. My circuits are tingling. We shouldn't have faced again sometime. Alright, so I'm still missing... On to... Toi. I'm missing four, so I've got half of them. Not too shabby. Mm -hmm. Right, so... Whoop. Into the hotel! So many choices, it's too overwhelming. Only through meditation will I find the answers. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> Why won't they be reasonable? Flag won't even talk. I'm not apologizing first. Okay. Wait, ah, oh, there's toilets! Ew! Yeah, you can't go in them though. What a shame! Lots of important people stay at our hotel. Take Mel Droid, for instance. He's an assistant to High Councilman Halpert, the leading proponent against Proposition 4. As you know, Halpert's an influential member of the council, as well as the man representing our section of the ring. I believe the Tutte Bros are staying on the third floor, but I can't tell you which room. We've had to eject three groupies and a cyborg in the last two hours. Critically acclaimed film cinematographer Dylan Dale is having a tantrum in one of our leisure suites. And someone p who paid me $200 not to reveal his name is staying here. All in all, I think we have an extremely popular establishment. Please leave, unless you are say staying. Should I actually give him that? That's very interesting. Yes, I'm a fountain of knowledge. Yeah, you can actually pay him to get the number of the person you're after, but you might not need to. No, if you just go up the stairs and open up every door, you'll probably find it. <coughs> I'm writing articles for Council News Nightly about two of today's initiatives. The Woggy Dot Herding Initiative and the... Is that Poos? I'm pronouncing that like Moose, because Moose is spelt the same way, I think. So, Poos Cafe Initiative. I can't finish either one. I can't find chef representative for surface horticulture, horticultural, uh, agriculture, des deskin anywhere, and I need his feedback. He will know better than anyone how the council would vote on the dot herding issue. I camped outside his room most of the afternoon. He's famous for always staying in room 401 at every hotel he goes to. He won his term of office by a mere 401 votes or something. Meanwhile, I can't find Mel Joyd, the assistant to one of the high councilmen. He promised me an interview about Councilman Halpert's position on Proposition 4 the Poos Cafe Initiative. I know he's staying at this hotel, but I haven't a clue what room. And to top it off, I don't think any of these colours are... Uh, is Poos Cafe. Poos. Whatever. Maybe you got these two. Maybe I voted wrong, maybe my one vote will be the one that upsets the balance of power in our democracy and bring it tumbling down all around us. All around us. How do you sleep at night? Okay, so they just say the same thing. Oh yeah, the... The item is not in here. I remember the thing saying. And also, I should save. Uh, whichever, it doesn't matter. Yay! So, I hate for you to hear it like this, Ted, but the fellas all took a vote and we've decided you should die. What are you saying? You guys have voted to kill me? No, no! We don't think you should be killed. Not at all. We just think you should die. I can't believe it. When? Soon. Very soon. Can I call my wife? You can do whatever you want, Ted. <laughs> what the fuck? How weird. What's taking the elevator so long? Maybe a lot of people coming down? Yeah, this is one of the best parts. <laughs> What's taking the elevator so long? Well, if you go up to floor 3, you'll find out. It's so stupid. But funny, so it doesn't matter. But yeah, floor 3. Ta-da! That's what's taking the elevator so long. A guy is stuck between the doors. We could pull on his legs, and that might sever his head. <laughs> So I quit playing with the elevator doors. It is against regulations to obstruct the elevator. Ow. <laughs> oh my god. Can't remember there, I can interact with this. Oh nice! Ooh, hello. We got a double up brace. Or bracer. I'll give that to Grumpos. Cause it's for people that use the beat skill. I think beat is quite literally just a, a melee attack. 
My career is going down the toilet. Oh, my career going down the toilet. I'm supplied with standard issue hard foam bevel pillows, and now outworlders walk into my room and harass me while I, while I rest. Please, take all my belongings, too. I'd hate for there to be an upside to the day. Don't worry, I won't look. Steal like all of the, all outworlders do. Go on. Wow. I mean, he ain't wrong. Of course I was going to take them. It lets me. And there's no repercussion to doing so, so, you know. If there's a repercussion to stealing, then I might... Maybe I wouldn't have stolen. Or I would have, but I would have made sure you weren't looking. It's not my fault. What the heck? There are reports of a red bipedry loose in the building. If I don't find it tonight, they're going to vote me off the security staff. Oh, no! And it says more people waiting for the... And it's a bus. Waiting for the elevator. What the hell are you doing? What do they say? I don't know, man. I think something's wrong. Dude, it'll come any time now. I think I did them the wrong way around. Non. Aha! Ah. Bum. Bum. I'm gonna try nine. Oh, not even close. Wait, it's a one? Oh god, no, it's seven. Alright. So seven, three. Oh god, four. I'm trying to play with one hand. It's two. Oh yeah! Mmm! <laughs> Best part is I didn't actually need to uh, buy the information about Mel Joyd's room. Isn't that nice? Yeah, because we're in it. So I didn't actually need to find out. Very good. Alright, we got heal grease complete. Oh god, get out of here. Yeah, this is what we need. Boop. So, to Mel Joyd. From High Councilman Halpert. After... After three furious days of endless debate, these... I can't read what that says. Something idiots refused to make Poo's Cafe the official colour of next year's festival. How will two... Wait, how will two? I'm really trying my best. How will two even face the Poo's Cafe's... or Cafe... Consortium? After this crushing defeat. My heart sinks... Not my heart sinks, Joyd. Jade, Joyd, can't remember his name. Think of the children. Pre prepare an apologetic letter immediately. I'd rather they hear it from you, from me first. Wait, so what was that? Number three. Oh no, it was number four. Wait, so Poos, Poos Cat is a colour. Oh. Well, the more you know, I suppose. Ba -da -da -da. Oh wait, floor three. Already been here. We need to go up to floor four. Right, and this is where the other bits of info is. 403, 402. Oh, here we go. This is actually the right one. Another heel grease. That's a plus, I think. Yeah! Woo! Yeah, this is what we need. What's a first for? It's the Democratus method of science. That's where I learned the principles to construct plasma wall. I was 10. Since we're traveling the galaxy, I should keep my eye out for interesting reading like this. I could learn a lot. Oh wait, no, that's not actually what we need. It's just something useful to look into. It's 401 that I need to be inside. Get gone, you jerk. Uh, okay. <laughs> Sorry to be a bother. Yeesh. Realize. Hey! Ah, oh, taco! Nice. A taco and a heel grease complete. Oh, very nice. Oh, there we go. Ding ding. You found the taco. Yeah, what you need is what's on the the bedside table. This ting. Without a legend or directions, there's no frame of reference for this map. Or is there? Yeah, there we go. Analyze. What? Roe Bowman's Analyze. Analyze simulates the thought connecting process of Roe's brain as she figures out a diagram or machine. You must select the converters below in the correct order to convert the initial shape and colour to the end shape and colour. Some converters insist on a specific shape and colour to convert from, so watch out. 
Oh, right, so that's like green. So that means it needs to start at green. That's yellow, so it starts at yellow. That's green, so it starts at green. That's red, so... Oh, wait, no, it's red or a vase, a vial. Oh, wait, I can't. Oh, no! How could I do that, then? That's how. Hey! There we go. Okay, I do understand how that works. This looks real weird. Oh, right, yeah. This is actually a really cool thing. It's like a diagram, but you have to hold it up in a certain, at a certain spot to find out where it is. The key to effectively analysing a problem is not to think too hard. Maybe a view from a higher vantage point might prove more illuminating. Let's try outside. There we go. And she's 100% correct. I also find how she runs really weird. Oh no, it just seems like she moves really quick. What the hell is this guy doing? Stress eats at me like femp fever forehead rot. Uh, okay. Is this the red bipedry thing? No? Guess not. Do 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 do. Don't know if I can go in any of these rooms. Don't think so. No. And no. Yep. She keeps wriggling out of her ropes. Then tie him tighter. She's already eaten all the food we left her. Already, then let her starve. She's a motor mouth. Talks my bleeding ear off. Then gag her. <laughs> Alright. Right, well, we're done in here. I've learnt the initiatives. Uh, the propositions. Either or, whichever. Well, that one of them I've not learnt yet. I'll learn very shortly, though. And block two. And floor one. Woo! We're out of here. Yay! But I'm still missing like two of them, I think. Yeah. I think so. I mean, I don't actually need to use the map, but I'm going to because it, it shows off something pretty damn cool. Yeah, we go up to this. There, check out Dust Duskin's strange map. Oh, are you serious? It's so dumb. Yeah, it's really cool. Because she'll hold it up and you'll notice it all lines up perfectly. So it shows meat here. And down there is where there was that thing you could interface with. There's PAL, so I'll do that. I don't remember the... Um, the... God, I can't remember what... I don't know what the word is that I'm looking for. Combination. In order to get into it. Da -da 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 -da. Fuck. Really gonna be this? I, it, I was gonna say, it can only be this. I've also realised this is taking very, very long. It didn't even get down to the final bar, I suppose. There we go, we got a heel grease. Complete. Another one. Ding, ding, ding. Woohoo! Figures Planet Dwellers would be involved in all this business. When I received the map several days ago, it didn't take me long to determine the meeting spot. So here I am, here you are. Where's my wife? What wife? We just want to know the council's stance on the uh, Woggy initiative. Tell us how the council will vote on the Woggy issue, and we'll tell you where your wife is. No, what wife? Really? Just kidding. Nobody kidnapped my wife. I'm just a big prankster. I don't even have a wife. The High Council will vote no on the Wagi Dot Herding Initiative. You're welcome. Goodbye. So we're missing two. We just have a felony. So that's the six, which is the speaker. And the two is uh, cyclical vomit torture be abolish. Or abolish cyclical vomit torture. Hmm. 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 Can I interface with you? Oh, I thought I could because you're a robot. Still with the attitude. Still, boy. You're lucky I am on duty. Do those receptors even perceive colour? You have made my day with your patheticness. Thank you. <laughs> wow, dick. I mean, I know where there's a desk lamp. It's just not the right one. Or it's not the one he's after specifically. Which is kind of bullshit, really. Yeah, that blue desk lamp, right here. So it's like, why can't I just take it? It's blue. It's a lamp. What's the big issue? Also, why can't I do anything in here? I think the the only reason... Oh my god, there's a gun. I am so glad I came back. Because I got a new gun. 
And also... Well, mostly just... Yeah, I got a new gun. <laughs> Holy crap. That sounds pretty good. So, Viston 3 beam. The weapon is poor. Viston Octogun. It goes up there. It fires. Ooh, a fair four-barreled energy gun. What else increases? Nothing, but my weapon is now fair, as opposed to being shit. Or poor, as the game put it. Right, so we need to find out the issues behind Proposition 2 and Proposition uh, 6. So the bipedery thing. No. I'm trying to think, who the bloody hell I talked to for Proposition 2? <laughs> I mean, I think I've spoken to every single person. I have not come across a person that's mentioned vomit torture. Nothing down here. I mean, there is over here, but I don't believe this leads anywhere. Oh my god, it was here. This is what we're looking for. What the heck? Hey, the lost blue desk lamp. Either way. I believe I need, um, Grumpos in order to yammer at that, that guy. We already opened this, I think, didn't I? Didn't we? Did we not? Pretty sure we have. I am not opening it again. Yeah, I'm almost certain that we did. There's also this over here, but it doesn't lead anywhere. Oh wait, no it does. Have I been in here? I don't remember. Ow. Well, zero is one. Zero another. It's probably two, this one. It is. Let's try four. Yay! 